Hi guys, so today we're going to learn about feature splitting. Now let me give you a basic introduction of what feature splitting is. So basically, as the name suggests, we're going to split the values in the feature to extract more useful data, right? So for suppose if from the name column, we only want the first names, our data set only requires the first names, then we can extract from this column only the first names. Now let's get started with the implementation. So if we have a text like this and we only want the words, then we can simply write print text dot. We'll use the split function and it will split out the words for us. So as you can see, we have the words, right? Now, if, a, if we have a paragraph like this and we want to split at the full stop and get these two lines in two different variables, then we can do it. We can take two variables as the output of the split function. So it would be now paragraph dot split. Now we have to split at the full stop. So we'll just write full stop. All right. And let us just print A and B. So it's print A and print B. So as you can see, we have the two lines, the two sentences. Now we can also give us the argument on how many words we want to split, right? So now if I want to split at and, then I can use this with a max split of one, then I can use this, that cars dot split. And we, are, we want to split at and, so this would be and, and let me just give it a space also. And max split of one would split in one words or basically it will just give one split. So we'll get two things, right? So we'll just print this. Okay. And we'll also print if we do a split of two. So it will give me two splits. So that would be cars dot split again with and with a split of two, right? So it's now let's see what we get. So as you can see, there's only one split. So it's Audi and the remaining. Here we have two splits. So it's Audi, Kia and the remaining. So now let's implement this on a features of data set. So I've only, I've already got the data set. Let me just print the data set for you guys. So it's df.head, right? So this is our data set, the NBA season 96 to 97 data set of all the players and suppose we want to split the player name in first name and the last name and we want to do it for the whole feature for all the values of feature so we'll use apply lambda or map lambda function to do for the whole series right let's just see how it works so let me write it as df dot let's call it first name would be First, we'll con convert all these values into strings so that we can split. So that would be df dot player name dot str, right? Now I will split at a space because Dennis space Rodman, so we'll split at space. So there we go. And this would only do for one value. If you want to do it for the whole series, we'll use the map function. So it would be dot map and we'll write the function here. So it would be lambda x and give me only the first name. So I'll only take out the first element of this. So this is this. Lambda x is basically a mini function, right? A convenient way to write a function. It would take all the values x belonging to this series and it would give me out the first element, right? So let's see how this goes. Let's check it out. First name right? So we got the first name. Now let's do it for the last name. So it's df last name. Again, df dot player name will convert to string, then we'll split at a space and then we'll take the last element, right? Writing a mini function. So that would be now the last element would be x minus one. So here we go. And now let's check out the last name. So it's last name, 
right dot head so let's see what we get clearly we've got the last names so this was the required explanation and i hope you guys find it useful thank you